Yeah, this should be a breeze. Should only take a half hour. Heck, I might make it to my little girl's recital. As long as Digman isn't put on this case, I mean, that guy's a nut job. He doesn't trust anything that's been put into practice in the last two decades. There's no way they'll put Digman on this heat. You gotta be kidding me. I don't know what you two are kidding about, but I can assure you that crime is no joking matter. Sir, everything's ready for you to examine. Uh, first things first, the killer's fingerprints are on the door. Yeah, well, so are mine, and we certainly don't want a little mix-up back at headquarters now, do we? <laughs> Wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. <clears throat> Sir, as you can plainly see, the victim was suffocated by this trash bag. Or, that's just what the killer wants us to think. Right. Well, finding the killer should be easy. The victim fought back and uh, stabbed the killer with his pocket knife. See? We found a pool of blood in the adjacent bedroom where the uh, killer collapsed, we assume, after he uh, was trying to flee. Ah. Righty. Well, uh, rev up the carpets in the adjacent bedroom and uh, call around and try to find some replacements. House goes on the market next week and I'm going to try to convince Martha to buy. Uh, great location. Love the high ceilings. Okay, well, sir, one of the neighbors told us upon arrival that they were walking their dog and witnessed the whole thing. Can't trust anyone without a badge these days. Shame, really. Detective, they even have pictures on their phone as evidence. Photoshop. Can't trust any photographer these days either. Damn liberals. Look, the killer's body is laying in the grass right outside the window. He didn't even get away. Case closed. I don't know. Just doesn't feel right. Uh, it's a college town. I see kids passed out drunk in the lawn all the time. It's 4.30 on a Tuesday. Is it really? I've got a dentist appointment I'm gonna miss. Can't miss that. I heard gum disease is real bad this time of year. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So just convict the dead guy outside and let's go. Hang on one second, officer. You seem real eager to get out of here. Well, you've got to be joking. Oh, crime's no joking matter, officer. I thought I mentioned that to you already. Seems to me like the killer's just revealed himself. <laughs> My hunch was right all along. Book him, Dano. Oh, for the love of Christ, come on. Oh, seriously? Come on. Shut up, Mark. I'll let you go once we get outside. But I'll, off this stupid case. But I'll, I'll be an outlaw. Just lay low for a few hours. I'll catch my daughter's recital, and then I'll clear it up with IPD later. What fun. What if, anything to get me away from this lunatic. Another case solved, Digman. What would the department do without you?